I think one of the aspects that made the Puritans, the Pilgrims, and later on the Great Awakening in the 1700s, uh, prior to the American Revolution particularly, and then it extended beyond that in the Second Great Awakening in the early 1800s in many cases, was the vision of victory for the future, a vision of hope for the future. Regardless of how dark it gets and regardless of how much tribulation you go through, nobody was looking at the fact that there would be no tribulation, no trials, no troubles. They looked that there would be great trials and great troubles. But they always held out the fact that, you know, they've read the end of the Bible and we win. The understanding of victory is very critical. The understanding of hope. And sometimes the darkest situations when it appeared that um, evil was winning, when it appeared that darkness was taking over. Uh, and it appears that way in every age. Uh, it appears that way for every believer. One of the greatest challenges for a believer today in light of the past and history is to see the global perspective. That, um, and in today, we have no excuse because we have greater information of what's going on around the world than, we, than we've had in the past. And to see that, you can see that Christianity is growing at a faster rate than it's ever grown before. And it's having a greater effect with believers. Even though in local locales and uh, in the United States of America, particularly with the great backslidden condition of the church, uh, it's a tendency for us to say, look at this. Uh, it looks like the end is near. It looks like everything is, is ending. Not so. Actually, whenever that has happened before, God has a, I call a neat strategy that we can always look at the future. And it's called ambush. He always allows evil to be drawn out into the open so it can be seen for what it is, that people would wake up and the church would go and get its revival, even if it's in the woodshed of revival, uh, through the church getting chastised by God. That ambush strategy is something we can look forward to because evil is going to be seen for what it is. And when that happens in every period of history, people by the thousands and the millions begin to turn to the true God because they recognize what they thought was only an illusion.